Hello, this is Brock with Tech Leverage, and I've been getting a lot of questions regarding Windows 8 and the desktop environment. That is, most people are missing their start menu. Well, there is a few options. You can go out and buy the start menu, or you can find a program to install it, and uh, it will put a start menu in your desktop environment. What I propose is you build one yourself, and I'll show you how to do that. First, we're going to go to our desktop environment. And then down at the bottom, where your start menu would be, you just see typically two icons. Well, let's start by right-clicking the bar down there, and we'll unlock our taskbar. Go up here to Toolbars, scroll down to New, new Toolbar. Okay, I've already found the area, but I'll start over. In the C drive, or D drive, depending on how your computer's set up, but typically in the C drive, you want to go to program data. Now one thing you do have to have enabled is you need to show uh, hidden folders. If we look back here you can see program data is a hidden folder. But Once you're in there go to program data, Microsoft, Windows, Start menu. And Inside you'll see programs. Now some people use the Start menu, they'll just select that folder. I select the programs folder. So we'll select that. It's going to put it right down here. Well, now we did unlock it, so we can grab the little bar there and drag it all the way to the side where the start menu would be. Now you can't go too far. It's, it's completely far over as you probably would like, but for the most part, you can get it close enough. Now the other bar ended up being on the other side, so we'll drag it all the way back. And then once we have it there, we can lock our taskbar again. And now when you see, when you click, you have a start menu with your typical stuff in it. So now whenever, whenever something is installed, it should auto-populate in this list. Now there's a few other things people miss, like the, the shutdown feature, or logout, or lock screen. There are commands you can learn to do that, but it's still simple if you just go to your one side of your Windows 8 machine. It will still bring up the bar over here. Maybe. There we go. And you can still do all that from here. So that's one thing. But I do say if you miss this start button to get the start menu and you really want it, I propose going this road. All right, this has been uh, a little look at uh, some Windows 8 tips. If you have any questions regarding, please feel free to contact me.